My name is Ken Stano with the Aviation YouTube channel History X here at the Commemorative Air Force Lake Superior Squadron taking you behind the scenes of the massive restoration project of this incredible PBY Catalina. Standing here with Squadron Commander Bill McMahon and you were telling me earlier that the control surfaces of this plane, all fabric covered, all need to be replaced. Yes, this is one big time consuming project for doing fabric. All trailing edges and we call them feathers, the elevator, the stabilizer, the rudder, the ailerons are all fabric covered. Every 15 years you have to replace all that which we've had to done with this. Currently we're on the second to the last control surface. Paint will have to go on them also. The fabric covered surfaces, the project is nearly done but not complete. You just, you're basically saying you've got two more pieces to go. Two more pieces as well as reconditioning the other ones that we've done. Uh, they've been sitting around now for 15, 20 years again without oh, okay. being installed. I don't foresee any problem with that because they have not been in the element or anything, but still we have to go back through them again. To complete this project that's nearly done, what's left? At this point here, we have the large 33 foot expanse on the trailing edges, which is the major ones that are on the main part of the wing. They are directly behind the engine. You save the biggest for last. Save the biggest for last, the most time consuming, the most involved portion of it. We're using a polyfiber system due to the nature of the two flight control surfaces we're doing now. So we're going to be stitching those. The very time consuming. That's where we sew together the uh, flight control surface from top to bottom. So what our next part of the project is, is go from the top rib to the bottom of the rib and we'll use a needle to stitch through there and we'll stitch the entire length of each rib on its own. Each person will sit on one side and we'll use a light from the other. And I believe we go every two inches will be a stitch as we go down through every one of the ribs. So one, one person will be on one side of the rib, and one person will be on this side, and you'll go back and through. And there's a special way you knot it on each side to uh, hold its strength and tension on the rib itself and it's the original style of installation. Now this isn't just regular fabric, what's the cost associated with it? To cover everything we did, we have acquired around a $10,000 bill for materials, dope and fabric, painting. There's a red coating that seals it and then on top of that you have to add a UV protection which is a silver coat that, that protects the fabric itself from being deteriorated by UV rays. Then on top of that, we have to paint that. If you want to learn more about how you can support the Commemorative Air Force Lake Superior Squadron's efforts to get the fabric covered control surfaces complete for this restoration project, please check out the link in the description below for this video. My name is Ken Stano with the Aviation YouTube channel History X. Thank you for watching.